Andrew McGahan for Severe MMA here at Bama 22, standing alongside Alan Philpott, who was victorious. And Alan, first things first, let's get it out there. What happened during the week? Were you sick? What happened that you couldn't get the last off? I was I was sick at uh, the start of the week. You know, I had the flu and a uh, sore chest and sore throat, but I'm not going to sit here and make excuses. You know, I still took the fight. It was a few weeks up the leading up to the fight. You know, I was just... I was questioning myself if this is what I wanted to do anymore. I, I don't know what happened come over me. I just everything was just coming on me at once, and I just thought, you know, is it worth it? Um, is, is all this worth it? And by the time I did switch on, it was just too late. But I've got no excuses. I'm a professional fighter. You know, that was my 38th MMA fight, uh, 21st pro, and you no, know, I should have made the weight regardless. What I say, you no, know, I, I just I messed up. I mean, I just Did something up. like that reaffirm to you that this is the life that you want? Yeah, getting that win, you know, in there. You no, know, even earlier sitting in that changing room, I was a bag of nerves, and I was sitting here, and I was just like, "What's wrong with me? Like, what, what are you doing? Why are you getting yourself in this state?" And then I just got that switch at the end. Like, I was like, you know, I says, "Man, I am the best. I know I'm the best man in the UK and Ireland." I was quite there tonight. Show it, have fun, relax. So, definitely the win there tonight. It gave me that extra kick, you know, again, I'm like, you know, this, this is what I want, this is what I need. You know, all my supporters, all the fans, my club, my teammates, you can see earlier, we're dominant. You know, they're the guys, they all believe in me. It's just a bit of self-belief now, and, you know, I believe it, and I will do I will get back to where I need to be. I think it's very hard for, sometimes people can forget you're 22 years old as well, yeah. um, probably one of the most experienced pros in the country at this stage as well. Yeah. Yeah, like I said earlier, um, I'm going to take a break now. Not just a break from away from everything, just from the fighting side of things. You no, know, I've got so much to work on. Uh, I need to, I need to be a lot more professional in the diet side of things. Uh, my attitude sometimes towards the training, the media, whatever. I just, I've got so much to work on. Like I say, I am so young, and I've got so much time. And you no, know, I, I know when I put the work in and do what I have to do, that I'll be up there in the top. I think frustrating, the most thing for you before I let you go is that you have made championship weight before. Uh, you were given the belt temporarily in the cage there. Were you, are you told now you're going to fight for that belt again? No, I don't think they said anything. I wouldn't expect, to be honest. Well, I don't know because I got the win. But like I said, I'm going to take a break. And by that time, no, I wouldn't expect them to hold it for me because I don't know when I'm going to be back. Yeah. Uh, and I don't think it would be fair in other fighters that's coming up through and that's putting the work in. Uh, I think, you know, if somebody else is in line for it, give them it, take a chance. You know, Regis Sugden's, uh, if there's no one else and he gets another shot, give the guy another shot. You know, I, it doesn't bother me that side of thing. You know, I just think of myself and my club and it's about time, you know, I just start acting the age and really do start giving it a proper go because my body can only take so much and if I do keep dieting and cutting weight the way I do, you know, I'm going to end up running my career before it even really starts. Well, Alan, hopefully your break isn't as long as you think it's going to be. Yeah. Uh, definitely we'll see you back in there as soon as possible. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Andrew. See you soon.